this is Sonia. Um, I'm, a, I'm a tad tired, and, uh, but I've come back now because I need to make the video for my 100th subby giveaway. And I have had seven entries, but I've got, well, I think I've got one here in my hand, so I'm just going to open this now. This is from Ruth. I think she sent me her things so I could have a look at them. Oh, look at this. This is really nice. Oh, look at that. She made me a card. Oh, isn't that good? <laughs> oh, that's very nice. Isn't that beautiful? <laughs> oh, look. Oh, there you go. I'll just have a little read here. This. <laughs> Thank you. That's all right. That's good. I really enjoyed showing you how to make that. Look, she's made the leaves. These are nice, aren't they? These are felt, and she's got um, um what's the name? Stick around the outside. And I like these little, little bits here. These are little twisted bits of um, wire or something. And there's a feather. She's put a nice piece of paper on that and distressed the sides. And this is really pretty, isn't it? <laughs> And then she's got me a heart there, a little, okay, a little, <laughs> another little hard one. Isn't that that's beautiful, isn't it? See, there you go. Now that's a that's a really good example of what you can do with the things that that um, I showed you how to make, and, and puts lots of texture and that into your work, doesn't it? Look at that, that pretty. I do I like that. That's very nice, Ruth. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. Um, now. Um, for the other things, um, uh, now, people made things and they put them up on videos and I hope that everybody got a chance to have a look and see what everyone done. Um, uh, I think Ruth might have been the first one and she showed me the, the flowers, the leaves that she did and I think that might have been, you know, with the needle lace work that I showed you. Um, then Maria showed me, she's from Boho Fantasy Factory, she showed me on there that she'd made a skirt for her doll. Um, Belinda DeWar, that's, um, she was junk shop junkie now, she is nostalgia, I think. Oh dear. Sorry Belinda. <laughs> uh, she made a doll, a bead doll, and she made a pair of pants. Now I would have that bead doll here to show you, only as you know I'm in the middle of fixing up my sewing room and uh, my friend came over yesterday and actually helped me because I just did not think she would. I thought, now there'd be no way. And I just sort of rang and said, um, Lucy, you don't want to come around and give us a hand? And she, she sort of said, yeah, so that's good. We got really stuck in it yesterday and I've sort of moved the cameras that in a different place because my table shifted, but um, we've still got a lot to go, but she'll help me downsize a lot without... Um, you know, making me cry, I don't think <laughs> we've got to get rid of some of the stuff, you know, because I've got a lot from my mum, so, but anyway, um, so that was those, those, um, three so far, then there was, um, that was Belinda Maria and Ruth's one, uh, entries, uh, Caroline, um, Weatherington, she did a bead doll, and I thought that was a really good thing, um, Teresa did the flowers. Teresa made a really good job of the flowers. I was really, really pleased with the flowers. Now, Nita did the leaf, and Nita did a fantastic job of the leaves. She did a fantastic job. And then today, I seen Marisol Pearl. <coughs> she, she had a, she did the flower center with a bead, and I, she did a really good job too. Now, I did say in the thing that I was going to pick out which one I thought was the best, but I just could not do that because they were all really good. So, I've decided then I will do it fair. I think this is a better way. It's, it takes a lot of load of pressure off me. Uh, so, I've got all your names here. So, there's, um, I'm going to put those into a little pot here, roll them up and sit them in there, and whoever's name I draw out. Now, if anybody doesn't like the idea of me doing this, they can just let me know. And, you know, because I, I, I just did, I wanted to do it this way because it was very hard. I think all you ladies, a lot of you have never sewn before and or did beading and you had a go. And I'm so pleased 
that you tried and you did such a good job. I'm, I'm really proud of all of you. <laughs> it's making me feel so good that you've done such a wonderful job on those things. Okay, so um, there you are. They're all in there. And whoever, whoever gets drawn out will get a little parcel. And I wouldn't be surprised if the rest of you as well too. But anyway, let's just see what happens, okay? So um, my, my winner is for for my 100th subby giveaway is Nita. Crafty Nita. Isn't that fantastic? Oh, I'm sorry, but you saw that it would have been fantastic, I'm sure. But I think um, a lot of you anyway um, know that I'm going to, well, some of you know that I'm going to be sending you out a little something because there's... Uh, a few think bits and pieces that I've got here so but Nita you're the winner of that and um and that is really good because I think you are she was really excited about making that thing and I'm so glad I, I think it's all worse some of you are a bit scared Teresa was scared but look that you did a really good good job you know you did a really good job and I'm, I'm you know I was, I was really I was really proud of all of this um, and I'm coming back and I'm going to show you so much more stuff because I can do so much more stuff that I want to share okay and uh, no, I haven't been shopping yet, but I probably will on the internet this week because I'll be home busy doing my, my sewing room and I won't be able to get to the shops. So anyway, thank you very much for watching, Anita. I do have um, your address, actually, so um, I will be sending that to you by the end of the week. And congratulations on your win. Okay, thank you very much for watching. Goodbye, everybody.